And y'all, so here's uh, my rough sketch. The tank, the canopy, uh, the trimming, all right? Um, behind this trimming is where the in built-in filter is going to be. Um, I haven't chose which side yet. Depends on the, the placement of the tank. Um, as you can see, it's going to be 10 foot long, 4 foot tall, and then 3 foot front to back. Um, yeah, so it's my idea there. It's a rough sketch. It's not probably going to be the actual thing. It's just an idea to go off of. And then on this page, I have my five stage filter, my built in filter. Um, so here's where the overflow of water from the tank is going to enter. All right, it's going to go down. The water flow is going to go up. This is where I'm going to house the heater and the floss. I'm going to have like a probably a piece of lighting diffuser here to hold up some floss to stop the splash so it's quiet so the water flow is going to go boom through here through the floss then it's going to come up and then there's going to be another stage of floss and foam so I'm going to do the, the foam on top and then the floss or the floss on top the foam underneath and it's going to go straight down it's going to come out the bottom of this tower through the mechanical sponges then it's going to go up come over into the bio i'm going to have lots of different bios in there probably some lava rock maybe some bio home i don't know if i have if i'm going to invest into that but you know it's going to be this this whole thing is going to be full of bio all the way to wherever the water line is. So it's gonna come down through the bio, go back up through the bio, come down, and this is the outlet where I just may house just the pump. I'm not sure yet. But it's gonna go down into the pump, the pump, boom, and then it's gonna return back to the, to the tank. All right, so that's my idea for my five-stage built-in filter. And this is going to be two feet and like I said it's gonna hide behind one of these okay so it's gonna you're not even gonna see it and the only way you're gonna see it is by the the gooseneck returns that's the only way you're gonna know there's a filter there all right so this is gonna be 24 inches and then behind it in the back corner I'm gonna cut a hole out and use a ball valve so that way I can attach a hose and open the ball valve and it, it drains the water. This is going to be my easy water change deal here. Um, now the thing is, is I haven't, uh, I haven't decided what substrate I'm going to use. Most likely it'll be sand. Um, but if it's sand, then I would just have to find, sorry, I would just have to find fish that's going to help me keep the sand clean. Um, if it's gravel, then I will build in, I was starting to, but I don't know what I'm using yet. So when it comes time to the build, I'm going to know what substrate I'm going to use. Most likely it's going to be sand though. And if it's sand, I can't, I, I can't use the under gravel jets because it'll create a lot of gas pockets. So, but that's pretty much my idea y'all um help me out if y'all got some cool ideas um shoot them my way all right hope y'all enjoy the video later